folks, welcome back to another edition of Action Figure Imagery Toy Reviews. Today we're looking at G.I. Joe Classified Series Dusty. And um, this is up close. He is figure number 49 of the series. And you see all the accessories he comes with. I love this artwork right here on the side. Uh, very good artwork indeed. Um, that was me wiping the dust off of the packaging. Uh, no pun intended, by the way. Uh, Dusty's. Uh, this is nice artwork. It looks like an actual human being. That I did a. They really have him look looking like a, an actual person on on this card art. This is really nice. He looks like an actual, real human being almost. Painted realistic looking artwork this time on the back of the size of the packaging. There he is again. Very nice artwork. As you see, he's in the desert. He's a desert warrior. And the back, uh, you'll get a better view of that in the slideshow. And these symbols, which I still have no idea what these symbols mean. Uh, I wish I did. I could explain. And you can pause the video, look at each one. Okay, folks, now you've seen Dusty in the packaging. Now let's take a look at Dusty out of the packaging. Okay, folks, here's Dusty out of the packaging. And here he is with one of his accessories, his gun. That's first, let's have a look at the figure first. Here he is with his helmet on. Or I'm not, I'm sorry, not helmet, but cap. And the goggles. Uh, take off the cap, see his face without the, um, without the cap, and um, see the war paint on his face, on the side of his cheeks, right there, the war paint, and it's nice right here, they got his, um, I guess that's his last name, Tudor, you can see his name right there, his real name, I'm not sure if that's his real last name or first name, I have to, I would have to read his, uh, profile on Wikipedia and the G.I. Joe logo was on his shirt. Uh, this is the only Joe figure I know for them to do this with. And as he got um, and you can see the green t-shirt. It looks like it might be a green t-shirt underneath his over shirt. His over his uh, military uniform, desert uniform. Um, reverse camouflage camouflage colors. I have his one of his weapons right here in his boot and his knife and I'll get to his accessories in a bit. And um, see Dusty has a hole in the back, his upper back for his backpack. <clears throat> and um, right here on the side looks like a, I keep forgetting what these things are called. Uh, they use them in the um, desert when they drink water out, out of these. I think that's what that is. And I'm sure you all are familiar with the articulation of uh, Joe Classifieds. And the head movement up and down, side to side. Excellent head movement. Uh, looking up, looking down. Arms outward. And pivot at the shoulder. And pivot at the elbow, bend at the elbow, and the wrist, and ab crunch, of course. Um, then you come on down, you have a upper thigh swivel right here. Then uh, pivot, knee articulation, and um, ankle do like that, and side swipe, and the boot up and down with the boot. Uh, as you see Dusty has a little uh, strap around his uh, ankle for his knife and this is a good pretty good cool figure I think. Uh, my only complaint about Dusty is uh, his hat is a little loose on his head sometimes I think. Uh, his hat doesn't fit as tightly as snug as I would like it to. It's kind of loose. If you shake him a little bit, he can... Well, it's staying on now. I put it on pretty hard, but 
sometimes it feels kind of loose. It doesn't feel real tight on his head. But um, um, now, now it's on there real tight. Now it's not coming off at all, no matter how much I. Okay, so it's it's pretty snug right now. I I thought it was going to fall off. It was falling off on me earlier when I opened him, when I opened him out of the packaging. But uh, now it's now that I'm doing the actual video. It's staying on. It's it's not falling off. Okay, so so much for that complaint. It looks like it. <laughs> now we can get to his accessories. Beside you've uh, already seen me cover his hat. Now let's. The gun that he has in his hand. Let's take a closer look at that. Let me put Dusty to the side for a moment and look at his accessories. Uh, and here's his gun. This is those. I don't know what kind of these are, but this has articulation right here. You can like it when he's laying on the ground, and you can put them in. You've seen these soldiers um, laying on the ground when they're getting ready to aim at their target at ground level, and they have that stand to stand their rifle up on the ground. <sighs> That's what that's for, and you see it also has a little um, um, s scope for the eye when you put their eye right there to look at their target. And also, majority of GI Joe classified figures have this little hole right here for the cartridge. Um, here are the rest of the accessories in this bag right here, the Ziploc bag. Let me take them out. <clears throat> the backpack, the other goggles. Alright, and you can just put the cartridge, um, this little cartridge piece, and insert it into the um, gun, like so, like he's reloading, or I don't know if it's upside down, there we go. Like he's reloading the gun, putting new bullets into it. Uh, a lot of figures got that. Now, now let's uh, look at his backpack. And like he has some more of those water containers that I was mentioning earlier. There's there's one right there. I keep forgetting what these things are called. Um, some more material back there. Another water container. And he comes with two pairs of goggles. And they are not the same size. These are the goggles. Uh, one is longer than the other. One is shorter and one is longer. I'm not sure the reason for that. But uh, you'll see more of that in the slideshow. And also, his knife that I currently have inside of his... Uh, uh, this is his knife right here. And you can just put it in his little ankle pouch right there. Slide it back in. And before we go to the slideshow, I uh, want to clear up a, a, something that a lot of fans, when they first saw Dusty, they thought that he was just, he looks too much like Duke in the face. I mean, take, remove his uh, helmet. And a lot of people were thinking that he's probably just a remake of Duke, that his facial sculpt, but well, here's Duke right here. You'll see more of these two together in the uh, slideshow. And as you can see, these two guys are not the same. They are not the same facial sculpt. A lot of people thought that Dusty and Duke were the same. Some, maybe some similarities, but they're not the same. Um, different hairstyles. Duke looks a little bit older. Dusty looks a little bit younger. So, um, Also, Dusty has brown eyes. If you look real closely, I don't know if you can see that or not. Dusty has brown eyes. And Duke's eyes are blue. So, and not just that, different haircuts too. They're not the same facial sculpt. They may look alike, but they're not the same. They may look like they could be brothers. Or I was beginning to think that too. Uh, that could he, he be a repaint of Duke, but he is not. And by the way, uh, if you look on this uh, channel, uh, I did a review on Duke uh, a couple of years. I think it was a couple of years ago, back in 2020, I think. Uh, a few years ago, so um, I guess I could put a link at the bottom of the uh, video to the Duke review if you hadn't seen it. But um, so there's your comparison with Duke and Dusty. Now let's go on to the slideshow. Okay, folks, here's Dusty um, in the packaging. It's previously shown in the original portion of the video. 
Here's the symbols, close up of the symbols on the side. As you, again, as you can see, he is figure number 49 in the franchise. There's the packaging art on the back. You can see all the figures. Characters have been made into figures. Here's Dusty, and you see what you get when you open him up, open up the packaging. All the accessories. There he is, right out of the packaging. That wasn't a good picture earlier, by the way. This is better right here. Sorry about that poor picture quality earlier on the other picture. Here's all the accessories up close. You see two um, goggles, the hat, the backpack, and there's the insert, the back insert. Right there, the uh, close up of Dusty's face. And that's not a good picture, neither. I'm sorry about that. That's not high quality photograph. That's a little bit better right there. Here he is with his hat on. And that's where he's known. That's the look he's known for with the hat, with the hat on. And and you see, he's with the hat on. He's about six inches, a little bit over six inches with the hat on. And there he is with the hat off. Still a little bit over six inches with the hat on, or whether it's on or off. And gives you an idea of how you want to display your dusty figure on your display stand. You want to display him with his hat or without the hat. And there you see, you look closely, the hole in his backpack. I mean, a hole in his back, back in the top of his upper back for his uh, backpack. Sorry about that. And left view profile of Dusty. And the war paint on his face. There he is with the with his gun, his main gun, and his head again right there. Right view side of Dusty, this time with the backpack on. All his main accessories. Back view. You can clearly see the um, all the accessories you need for a desert warrior. You see the the drinking bottles on the bottom of the pack. And there, there's another close-up shot this time with the goggles. One of the goggles on top of the hat. And there's been rumors saying that uh, him and Duke. As mentioned earlier in the video, are the same head sculpt here in this picture. You can clearly see they are not the same. They have different ha hairstyles. Plus, uh, Duke has blue eyes compared to Dusty having brown eyes. They are so you can clearly see they are not the same head sculpts. Many fans thought that Dusty was just a re uh, head was just a remake of Duke's, but now I've, as you see, and there's Duke with Dusty's hat on. If you want to see, they're not the same. That's it, folks, for this video. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Everyone have a blessed day, and we'll see you in the next video.